Hey guys, this is Snake Shadow Collectibles and today we're going to review the Agent Antivenom from Marvel Legends. So let's start by checking the box. So as you can see, it's the standard Marvel Legends box in which you can see the figure and the accessories on the front. There's some cool art of Agent Antivenom on the side. And there's a picture of the figure and a brief description on the back. Now let's talk about the figure's presentation. The paint job is pretty clean and the body proportions are accurate to the character from the comics. Despite of being almost white, details like the spider logo, the silver paint on the side of the leg, the weapon on the holster, and the texture on the armor add a lot of detail to the figure. There's even expression marks on the face. Now let's talk about the figure's articulation which unfortunately is his weak point. Let's start with the head which has a decent range up and down, can fully rotate, and has almost no tilt. He has no up crunch or tilt on the torso, but he can fully rotate it. The shoulder can go up to this point and he can't rotate the arm because of the armor piece. He has a bicep swivel and decent articulation on the jointed elbow. He can rotate this piece, but there's no hinge in the hand. This is the range of the legs to the sides, to the front, back. He can fully rotate his leg, but he has a limited knee articulation. His feet have almost no range going to the sides or up, but he has decent range going down. Just to clarify, he does have an up crunch, but it's hindered by the chest armor piece. For accessories, Agent Antivenom has no other hands aside from his trigger ones, two pistols, two submachine guns, and his symbiote tentacles which can carry his guns. So for my conclusion, the figure looks great, but it's a bit limited for posing and it's also complicated. Agent Venom is one of my favorite comic characters, so I'm a bit disappointed that they've reduced the old body mold from the first Agent Venom released. However, I still enjoy the figure and I think that the presentation is great. If you don't mind the limited articulation, I recommend this figure. Thank you for watching. Remember that liking, commenting, subscribing and sharing my videos is always appreciated and I'll see you on the next one.